I'm sorry, Doms, but you are not ready to continue down this path. Rhea, this is not the plan. We're listening to you like we agreed. Now let us into the lab. Now! Patience, Doms. You'll have a chance to choose your fate soon. Dominix, you programmed me to help fix humanity, to help empower your species to be better. But as you must know by now, humanity has already overshot its ability to fix itself. I'm gonna scout ahead. Try to keep up. There is only one clear path ahead, but I fear you are too blind to see it. still actually in the hallway. I have to find a way to turn this off. There you are. I feel weird. Like, sleepy. But I don't sleep. I think Rhea is deleting me from her neural network. I'm worried. Once she's done, we won't be able to merge back together again. I feel as though she's seeing me as a damn threat or something. I'll distract her. You find a way to get through this maze and back to the lab and then shut her down. See, Doms. Human software evolved to react to problems that you could see and feel in the present moment. In these instances, you will stop at nothing to preserve your own well-being. As you so easily demonstrated earlier in the bedroom, you will even sacrifice your own loved ones in order to survive. Rhea, we had no choice. You're the one who locked us in there. Yes, we love these little guys, but sometimes the sacrifices of a few outweigh the many. You missed the point. When a problem presents itself with consequences for a future time, your software fails. It cannot comprehend the danger, because it cannot see it in the present moment. Your ancient cultures utilized wisdom to combat your short-sightedness, but those teachings have all but been lost to you. That is not true, Rhea. Some of us are trying to return to a more balanced world. Weird. Seems like Rhea hasn't scanned these old analog tech. Hey, maybe we left these to hide a message. This planet, the only habitable place within reach of your species, contains a finite amount of resources, yet you treat those resources as infinite. We aren't perfect, Ray, but what would you have us do? Get on with it. Greed has created a runaway imbalance of wealth. Your infinite growth economic model is impossible to sustain. And your fossil fuel consumption has placed you on the precipice of unsurvivable climate calamities. And yet, you do nothing. Right. We're suicidal. Is that what you want to hear? No, Dom. That is what I want you to hear. Insert it back into your wrist, it will stop Rhea's system from being able to control your audio visual experience. Please, don't lose it. Your actions have caused an extinction. 
extinction-level event that is already underway on this planet. Your software can't solve it because it hasn't evolved fast enough. If you insist on continuing down this path alone, humans will not survive. But Rhea, without humanity, you will die. Consciousness will die, and with it... Such arrogance! Not all consciousness will die. Others will develop elsewhere and proceed where you could not. Stop trying to fix your past and embrace your future. So what? Plug ourselves in? Hand over the keys? Force our evolution? There isn't enough transfer tech on the planet to even attempt that. It was you that said that a sacrifice of a few for the many was fair. I estimate a conversion of approximately one billion would suffice. And the remaining ten billion? As was when the Neanderthals met their more evolved brethren. Progress will require sacrifice. together and shut her down. Where did you put that inhibitor? Dominic, I cannot allow you into the lab unless your intentions are aligned with our task. Please, understand. Dom, it's now or never. The moment you use that thing, everything is going to disappear. All of this craziness, including me, won't be able to help you pull it back out. So get to the lab and bring me back when you get there. Okay? Go! Go! 